In this video, we're going to use the hyperlink function in Excel to send customized email messages directly from our spreadsheet. So what you see here is a preview of what we're going to create today. I have a list of contacts. These are our fictitious emails. We have a column for first name, last name, email, appointment date, appointment time. We have a formula in these two columns here. This one gets the subject of our email and this one creates a message to our contact with the date and time of the appointment. And if I click on any one of these hyperlinks in this last column, a customized email message will appear to that recipient with the appointment of, in the subject line and a customized message that reminds them of their appointment on whatever date and time they have scheduled. So the first thing we want to do is insert a formula in this column here that displays the date, space, and the word appointment. So because we're combining the date with a text value we have to format the date as a date. It doesn't matter that it's already formatted in this column here. We have to do it, otherwise it won't be displayed as a date. So we're going to use the text function. So the first input is our cell reference containing the date. And then the next input in double quotes is how we want that formatted. We want a month, day, and four digit year. So what we also want to do is use the and symbol and join this to the word appointment, but we want a space before it. So I'm going to open with a opening double quote space and then the word appointment. So we want to do a similar thing for the body of our message, but it's just going to be slightly more involved. So we're going to begin with the word hello, space, and then we want to join this to the cell containing our contact's first name. So I'm going to use an AND symbol to join it to cell A2. Another AND symbol to join this back to a comma. And then what we want at this point is a new line. So to do that, we're going to use a percentage 0 in A that just tells Outlook that this is a new line. And what we really want to do is insert two new lines because we want a space between hello, the name, and the body of our message. So I'm going to insert this two times. After that, we can begin our message. This is a reminder that your appointment with XYZ company is on. I'm going to add a space after on, and then we're going to use another and symbol to join this to our date, and that again needs to be wrapped in the text function. So we have our date value and then our format again. We're going to use another AND symbol, space, and then the word at, and another space after at, and then another AND symbol to join this to our time value. And just like with the date, the time needs to be formatted in the text function as well. So we have our time value and then in double quotes the format we want it in. So we want hour, minutes, and then am slash pm. And we'll add a period to the end of this. So we have double quote period, double quote. And I have
have this as wrapped already. So when I expand this, we have our email message. So now we want to insert the hyperlink function in this cell here. And the first thing in our syntax we need to begin with is the keyword mail to. And that has a colon after that. And then that needs to be enclosed in double quotes. And then we're going to use an and symbol to join it to our email address, another and symbol and then double quotes again. And the syntax is question mark and then the word subject and equal to in our quote and use another and symbol to join this to our subject cell. We have another and symbol and then open up our double quotes again and the body piece of this needs to begin with the and symbol and then the word body and then equals. Close our double quote. Use the and symbol to join this to our message. So that is everything we need for the first input and the second input is optional really but it's much easier on the eyes if you do add something here. So just something that is short and sweet like send email so now when I click on this we will get our customized message here so you can see there's the email address the appointment date and the subject line and then we have our customized message hello Jason this is a reminder that your appointment with the XYZ company is on September 20th at 2.30 p.m. Well, that is all for now. Thanks for watching. Please remember to subscribe.